Hey guys, Show Raven here. Uh, Pokemon Direct has come and gone this morning. I did not get a chance to watch it live since I was at work, so I'm going to be doing a quick reaction video now to it. Uh, I've been avoiding the hell out of social media for the last little while, so I actually haven't heard what's going on, so thankfully no one spoiled it for me. Uh, so yeah, let's get this underway. Yep, 25th anniversary, yep. So what are we looking at here? Gen 4 remakes. New Let's Go, maybe. Well, this is pretty good going through the history. Yep, I remember that well. Hmm. Oh yeah, pinball. Oh, I played the hell out of that game back in the day. Getting a new one, thankfully. Do not miss the link cables, I tell you that. Oh yeah. Right. So we're just going through like a five minute segment of every single product they've ever released, huh? And this is where I got back into the franchise after a long time out. Yeah, this is about the point where I start remembering all this stuff, because I... Ah, uh, Poken. I played the hell out of that. Played a bit of it competitively, but I am so out of practice now. Oh yeah, Shuffle. There's Pokemon Go, yep. God. M must you guys mention the trading cards and the anime for every single generation? Like, yes, we get it, it happens. God, I played that more than I would ever like to admit to. I'm still gonna play that. That was a good movie. Current gen. Yep. Yep. 
Yep. Yep. I feel like that didn't have to be a five and a half minute long segment. <laughs> but the history lesson is appreciated. Hello everyone. There you are. Shihara from the Pokemon Company. Mm -hmm. February 27th is the date Pokemon Red and Pokemon Green were released in Japan. Yep, Pokemon Day. Marking the beginning mm -hmm. of the Pokemon series. An astounding 25 years have passed since the Pokemon series was born. We've shared so much with you over the past 25 years, through our games, but also through so many other mediums, thanks to the support you've all shown us. Thank you, each and every one of you. So, what are we revealing? Today, Mr. Utsunomiya will introduce our latest updates. So, Gen 4 remakes, let's go, maybe info about Pokemon Sleep. What are we doing? Okay. The thing we knew about, yeah. Okay, more info about Pokemon Snap is very much appreciated. Welcome to the world of new Pokemon Snap. Oh, yeah. Is the lentil region. Lentil region, yeah. Through the jungle, across the desert, and even under the sea. Okay, the yeah. Pokemon in their natural habitat. Both lot though? Mm-hmm. And of course, you won't be alone. Professor Mir, who's doing research in the lentil region, and research team members Rita and Phil are there to support you. And yes, Phil. <laughs> Research started by watching wild Pokemon. Oh, you can discover yeah. behaviors and expressions that are rarely seen. Look, a surfing Alolan right hmm. Actually, making it surf instead of just float surfing. Let's try throwing it a fluff fruit. That's it. Now's our chance. Oh, it's Tyranitar. What a wild way to eat. A park at night. And sir, let's try playing a melody. Oh, that sure made Hoot Hoot happy. Okay. You'll also have Illumina orbs, something the professor invented. If you use one of these, you can make any Pokemon glow. Oh, so that's not just a rare phenomenon. That's just a thing you can do. Okay. That's. Kind of disappointing, but... Venusaur jumping like a frog into a pond is actually really cool. Okay, yeah. In-game Photoshop. And filters, of course, they put filters on things. We know that feeling well. Like in-game Photoshop and Instagram. Alright. I mean, if you were going to do modern Pokemon Snap, I guess that's exactly how you do it, right? even be featured and get more attention. Seeing something like that may inspire you to go back and take even more photos. We're getting closer to the start of your adventure. Oh. Unexplored islands and plenty of Pokemon await in the lentil region. So make sure you're prepared. Whoa! Is that the mythical Pokemon Celebi? Yeah, yep. You can take pictures of Celebi? I'm in. 
wonder how many Pokemon in the Pokedex are actually going to be in that game. Well, find out sooner or later, I'm sure. I hope you're looking forward to the game's release oh. on April 30th. April 30th! Okay. Next, I'd like to tell you about several events for Just another to celebrate Pokemon two months. In the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield games, I've already heard about this. Max Raid battles featuring Gigantamax Pikachu are underway. So this weekend, take on Gigantamax Pikachu again. I, I tried playing Cafe Mix. Meh, not really for me. In Pokemon Go, Articuno, Zapdos, Moltres, and even Mewtwo are appearing in legendary raid battles as All right. a yeah, yeah. themed celebration event. In Pokemon Masters EX, uh, the gotcha game. Okay. That's cool, I'm sure, for the people who play that. We hope you'll enjoy these events. Next, I'd like to present the latest news about the Pokemon okay. game series. Okay. Have a look at Here we go. Here we go. What is it? What's it gonna be? Sinnoh? I feel like I feel like the Gen 4 remakes are just an inevitability at this point, right? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. We went back in time to about the right time, period. Yep. Yeah. Oh, this is the Gen 4 remakes. Alright, here we go. Please don't be let's go. Please don't be let's go. Come on. Uh, um, uh, Not entirely sure how I feel about this right now. Okay, the art style is what it is. I was expecting this done in the Sword and Shield engine, but please tell me there's at least wild Pokemon battles. Okay. Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. Okay, that gives me hope. They didn't call it Let's Go. Don't know about the... Like, the art style is what it is. I mean, the last remakes were Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire? What? This is a tale from a long, long time ago. What's this? The Shino region was still only a vast wilderness. A certain village bustled with the comings and goings of people. While in the mountains and seas, Pokemon okay. roamed as they pleased. I'm interested. What is this? I... Okay. Buildings all have a very feudal Japan feel to them, as do the costumes. The art style looks like it's... Looks like it's just one of those old Japanese paintings, so I guess that's the whole direction they're going for with whatever this is. Okay. Uh-huh. That... That is a really weird selection of starters, if that's the starters. I... Okay. Those are really old-looking Pokeballs, too. They got a little lock mechanism on the front, too. Ooh. Oh my. 
All right, Arceus. Yeah, uh-huh. Pokemon Legends. Arceus. Ooh. 2022. Okay. I'm pleased to announce two new additions to the Pokemon video game series. Uh-huh. Both taking place in the Sinnoh region. First, I'd like to present the Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Yeah, Pokemon. okay. Yep, the remakes. Yeah, yeah. These are faithful remakes of the Pokemon okay, Diamond. Okay, they are remakes. All right, they're not Let's Go redos. Okay. Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl games. Remakes of the Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pearl version games, which were released for the Nintendo DS system, are coming to Nintendo Switch. These games will be developed by Ilka Inc., oh. who also worked on Pokemon Home. Oh, okay. By Yuichi Ueda so it's Oka not a Game Freak game. game. Well, okay, Masuda. Masuda's in on it at least, so. Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pro version games. Your adventure will take place in the Sinnoh region. Rich uh -huh. in nature and with towering Mount Coronet at its heart, it is a land of many myths passed down through the ages. The sense of scale of the original game's towns and roots has been carefully preserved, and you'll be able to travel... Yeah, because it's still a top-down game, again. so... You'll set out on your journey after choosing either Turtwig, Chimchar, or Piplup as your first partner Pokemon Hashtur in these games. You Hashtag Team Turtwig. Together ...with all the Pokemon from Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pearl version. Newcomers and previous visitors to the Sinnoh region alike can look forward to experiencing the original Pokemon Diamond and Pokemon Pearl story. Alright, I'm actually still kind of looking forward to this. It's... Overall, and I know a lot of people love it, I think Gen 4 is like my least favorite set of games. Pokemon so I am looking forward to the remakes giving an have I'm giving the remakes an opportunity to kind of make me interested. Next, allow me to introduce you to Okay. Yes, please. Explanations. Pokémon Legends Arceus represents a new approach for the Pokémon video game series. Development is in full swing at Game Freak. We mm -hmm. to deliver a gaming experience that breaks new ground for the Pokémon series. Yeah, yeah. That definitely looked different. Interesting. Different. Alright, let's see. The events of this game unfold in the Sinnoh of old. And this time, too, Mount Coronet towers over the center of the region. I mean, it's kind of an important place, so yeah. Freely in the wild here, but the harsh environments may be different from the Sinnoh region you remember. In this era, people have journeyed to Sinnoh from all over and found it a prosperous village in the hope of learning more about this land. As for these three Pokémon, Rowlet, Cyndaquil, and Oshawott, it seems they were brought to Sinnoh by a certain professor who encountered them while traveling around various regions. I bet. You'll set off on your adventure <laughs> after receiving a first partner Pokémon of your own from this professor. So rather than make new characters per se, they just redid the OG protagonists of uh, Gen 4 as older, feudal era versions of themselves. Even in this era, wild Pokemon can be caught with Pokeballs. You can also engage in Pokemon battles alongside your Pokemon allies. Okay, but you can still battle wild Pokemon too, instead of just whipping balls at them. That's good. And strive to complete your Pokedex. Now for the mythical Pokemon that yep. traces the game's title and story, Arceus. According to legend, Arceus shaped all there is in this world. But how is this Pokemon connected to your journey? Mm -hmm. The answer to this question and more awaits you in this exciting new action RPG adventure for the Nintendo Switch system. Action RPG with Pokemon. Ooh, I am super interested, actually. Kind of digging the art style, too. Mind you, it's just CG with a filter over it, but still looks pretty neat. Though I can imagine it might be a little 
bit of an issue for some people. Each one distinctly different from the other, mm -hmm. with the wonderfully nostalgic Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl, as well as the Pokemon video game series New Journey, Pokemon Legends Arceus. As Pokemon celebrates 25 years, we will continue to challenge ourselves and deliver new ways for everyone to enjoy Pokemon. All right. So that's it. That's the presentation. Thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, this has been a pretty good presentation on their part, for as far as I'm concerned. New information about Snap. We have a release date. They got info on a bunch of other things going on. The announcement of a brand new... Uh, the announcement of a brand new set of games. The Sinnoh remakes that we've all been uh, kind of waiting for. Not a Let's Go game, though the animation style is very much that for the most part. And, uh, yeah. On top of that, we also have that brand new game. It kind of looks like Breath of the Wild meets Pokemon, but, uh, quite frankly, uh, I didn't really have a channel and I wasn't streaming back then, but back before, uh, Sword and Shield came out, that's actually kind of what I was hoping for when it came to Gen 8. A different kind of game, maybe like Breath of the Wild with Pokemon ro free roaming, with you able to explore and do stuff with them. And, like, my idea, though, was more like a Pokemon meets Minecraft or Valheim or whatever, where it was just a giant open-world map and you would be founding a new region. But, hey, I'm down for whatever this is. This looks very interesting. Uh, thank you guys very much. Uh, I know it's a bit of an off-kilter uh, video here, but, uh, hey, might do more of these if it does well enough. Uh, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I will see you guys later. Peace.